Hello everybody, my name is Barishan and today I'm going to talk about the problems with Halloween. Before I get to the main subject, here's a little history. Halloween was first originated because there was a belief in evil spirits and ghosts or whatever that came back from the graves. It's what I heard. Yes, it's a little windy outside and I believe it's going to rain, I don't know, now. It's that time of the year again and it's time. In a few days later we'll be trick or treating. Now, us guys know what it means to trick or treat but girls don't know at all because they instead go as a princess or a fairy. Tell me what's scary about that? Now in the USA they absolutely adore Halloween because they just like to decorate the houses. There are pumpkins everywhere. Everywhere they go there's trick or treaters walking left and right. They their bags are full of candy as they call it in the USA but in here in the UK I wouldn't say it's the complete antithesis but life is somewhat different yeah and the number one thing that pisses me off the most is the restrictions the F ethnicity, the race and the religions. Yeah. Anyway, whenever I go knocking on someone's door, these stingy Asians pop up and they just, the humiliation they do is just unforgivable. If you don't like living here where there are trick or treaters, coming up to your house wearing horror masks and horror costumes then get out of this country you Asian fucktards live somewhere else where you're much more able to adapt otherwise just kill yourselves now that's out of the way let's move on to something else the trick or treaters I like to talk about them that's much more charming isn't it Now, here's how the story of the trick or treaters work in my house. Knock knock, who's there? I open the door and there's a family of witches and wizards at my house. Okay, I take the tray off my treat and they take them and they go off. I close the door and the next lot arrive. Knock knock, who's there? I open the door and a family of zombies come out of my house and I hand out the tray, they take the treat and they go off. I close the door and the last lot come out. Knock knock, who's there? I open the door and this five year old dressed as a princess comes and I'm like, what? But I can't really <coughs> point at it and say, that's not scary. But that would just hurt her feeling so I and I'm starting to run out of treats too so my dad just takes out his wallet and hands over the money and they just go off so they close the door and now it's my turn to go trick or treating and I just go all over the streets where I live and now they've pull me back and it's the end of the day but wait it gets worse one of my cousin's birthday is also on Halloween and so therefore I have to stop trick or treating early and oh, how did this even happen and not only that when I always say take one why do the kids always take a whole handful and they run off you greedy children and there will always be that one time where there will be extra 
guy standing looking down at me and I'm thinking I know I'm a bit too old because 18 may be the age where you turn into an adult but you're like in your 20s or your 30s and you look like some kind of serial killer where you're dressed so casually wearing nothing but a mask covering your face I mean how come I mean why are you looking like some kind of loner yeah well I'm actually trick or treating with my sister okay where is she yeah she's right next to me she's like Casper in it really I'm mean, really supposed to believe that you, you know what fuck it give me the sweets see these are the kinds of problems that I have in the UK on my road where I live in London so, uh, I think now I don't believe there should be an age or height restriction with trick or treaters but if you're going to do trick or treating do it right and for you local residents make sure you treat your trick or treaters with respect stop humiliating them like banging on the doors and faking them out or giving them stuff that they shouldn't get like bits of scraps yes the humiliations that they do is give them leftover bits of food trust me I got them once too it's it's not pleasant so yes in a few days time we'll be going out and it's time to scare the living daylights and the shit holes out of the bitches let's go <laughs> anyway like comment and subscribe if you're feeling generous share too peace oh, I'm so tired right now